How's it going guys? Alex with iTech Triad and in this video we're going to be giving you a room slash office tour of where we get our work done. So come on in. This is our office and this is where we get all our work done here at iTech Triad. So everything you see on the channel, on the website, uh, through our application, the work gets done here. So let's start off on this side of the room first. I'm going to kind of talk about this poster we have here. Uh, I was at Sprint the other day inquiring about the iPhone 5S and I saw some posters and I asked them if they throw them out or what they do with them. They said they throw them out and I was more than welcome to take some so we got this pretty cool poster for the S4 and the HTC One. Gives it a real good uh, tech feel to the office. Now moving over here we've got Ben's Chromebook um, in which we do website editing and we also have our scripts for our video sometimes and uh, he'll talk more about specs towards the end of this room tour. Here we've got some drawers which a bunch of junk in them. Uh, here at the bottom we've got all our giveaway items which are yet to be shipped out and claimed so check our previous giveaway videos and see if you've won. This is where we get most of our videos done. It's kind of nice beautiful white table. Probably planning on maybe filling in these different lines here and making it really, really smooth, giving it a different feel. But uh, here we had our iPhone 5S unboxing. Got the 5S here, 16 gigabyte model. I'll leave a link in the description below so you guys can check out that video. Here we've got an old iMac box. This is a 2011 21.5 um, inch uh, display model. So that's the one that's upstairs. Got some old computers, speakers, keyboards, different tech junk in there. Here we've got an AC unit as well to help us keep cool while we're working in the office. Okay, so here we've got our shelf of probably most of the products that have been featured here on the channel. Uh, we're kind of box geeks, so we kind of keep everything, but uh, we'll kind of tour through the products that have been featured or used here on the channel. Uh, here at the top, we have a first generation Nexus 7 box. This is a 16 gigabyte model. Here we have the second generation Nexus 7 box, which is as well a 16 gigabyte model. Have a Galaxy Nexus on Verizon. Now that sticker usually doesn't come on the box, Ben just decided to go ahead and put one on there. Uh, here we have a Cisco um, dual band N750 router. Uh, it's pretty decent. I'm probably going to upgrade uh, later on when I get a chance. Over here towards the left side at the bottom we have an HTC Evo 4G which decided to just die uh, as soon as the two year contract was up. Don't know why. Uh, here we've got some Skull Candy headphones, Galaxy S3 box. This is a uh, as well 16 gigabyte model on Sprint. A random Beats Solo HD box, which for some reason I found. I don't even own any, so just kind of threw it up there. Here we've got a Bluetooth headset for the PS3, which has also been unboxed on the channel. I'll leave a link in the description below for that, as well as a Yeti Blue mic, which uh, we are constantly using for voiceovers and different videos as well. Also here we've got an unclaimed product for our giveaway, this is an Xbox 360 headset so keep an eye on the channel, we'll probably be hosting another giveaway for that as well. Here on the other side we've got a Canon Rebel T3i box, that's the camera that we use for all our videos along with a 50mm lens box. Now coming down here to the bottom corner, this is kind of the Apple section as I like to call it. Here we've got an old iPod Nanos, Apple Care Protection Plan, this is a MacBook Pro which we just recently got. The unboxing will be up on the channel soon once it is. I'll leave a link in the description below. We'll talk about specs more towards the end of the video. Old EarPod box, iPod uh, second generation, iPod Touch. Uh, that one's not working either. All these iPods here don't work. They're just kind of broken. So here we have an iPad third generation. That's the one with the Retina display. This is a 16 gigabyte model. Old iPad dock um, as well as those EarPod cases yet again. Here we have an iPad 2. This is 16 gigabyte model but this is the uh, 3G version on AT&T. And just recently added is an iPad mini 16 gigabyte uh, with data and that's with Sprint. So that's been unboxed as well. Um, that unboxing is coming up. We'll leave a link in the description below when that's up as well. Here we also have a 4 gigabyte iPod Nano box which that's an old one there as well. Here at the bottom we really don't have much, very minimal. We have uh, our charger for our camera, um, just notebooks, uh, some old magazines for computer power user, and um, some old logos that we we're kind of looking at. So that's here as it comes for this shelf. Now let's take a look at our products. Okay, so before we get into the products, just real quick, here's another poster that I got from Sprint. Um, this is for the iPad. So just kind of threw it up there as well to give it that real tech feel. But if you come around here with the camera, Ben, here is basically our products. Here we have the Bluetooth headset, which was unboxed on the channel. Uh, here we have two beautiful DualShock 3 controllers. Uh, 
I've sold my Xbox 360 getting ready for the Xbox One, so sorry, I uh, don't have that with me now. Here I've got a flat screen uh, in which will run the Chromecast and the PS3 as well. Here I've got my nice chair, which is very comfortable, much better than the previous chair I was using. And uh, here we've got the iPhone 5S, in which we picked up earlier. Talk more about that towards the end of the video. Uh, Galaxy S3, iPad Mini, uh, there's our Blue Yeti mic, uh, MacBook Pro, Ben's tablet and Timothy's iPod Touch. And back behind the TV hidden, we have our cables and our PlayStation 3. Now if you come around here, here we have this kind of uh, kind of cart, um, has wheels, can move it around, but Ben usually will throw his laptop on here, um, just different cables, phones, here you have his Galaxy Nexus. Uh, down here is just more junk, we'll have, kind of have boxes for anything we gotta ship. And down here at the bottom of the cart, we have just different kind of little shelves, flash drives, parts, devices, because uh, sometimes I would repair iPods, so I kind of had that there to just keep organized. So not much there. Uh, that's the cart. Here we have a stand for our mic, in which we'll use for voiceovers along with a pop filter. Uh, back here we have our box for our tripods, um, as well as a stereo, um, that's a, excuse me, amplifier. Here we have our tripods, a Star Trek poster, because we need a Star Trek poster. And here we have this beautiful chair in which I got from my boss. I mean, it is so awesome. You can just basically almost like curl up and sleep in it. It's, if it's an entire human, it's, it's pretty cool. Okay, so after my beautiful 20 minute nap in that awesome chair, we're gonna move back to this corner of the office where we record our videos. And what we're gonna do is me, Ben, and Timo, we're gonna talk about our daily drivers, the devices we use, how they help us in uh, bringing the content to the channel, website, and app. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start off with Ben, and he's gonna talk about his daily drivers. So here we've got Ben, and he's gonna talk about his daily drivers and how they help him uh, when he's doing work at iTech Triad. Okay, so here I have a Samsung Chromebook. It has two gigs of RAM, runs a Chrome OS. It's really good just for posting articles on the website, reading the news and stuff like that. Over here I have a Toshiba satellite. It has six gigs of RAM and an i7 processor running Windows 7. This is where I do my main editing for videos and the website. And it really does the job well. Here I have my Nexus 7 second generation and this I just use to catch up on the news and stuff like that. Video watching, all that. And I have my Galaxy Nexus, this is my main daily driver cell phone, and here I have my LG Bluetooth headphones, and I don't think I can live without these anymore, because they are amazing and just a lifesaver. I can't go back to the tangled cords. Okay guys, so here I've got my daily devices that I use every day. Here first off is the phone I've been using currently, and that is the iPhone 5S. Was using the iPhone 5 previously to kind of test iOS 7. I've uh, been loving it so far. I'll have kind of a review video soon talking more about that and whether it's worth the upgrade. Here to the other side, I've got the iPad Mini, which I actually picked up with the 5S, got a great deal on that. And I've got to say, I love using the iPad Mini much better uh, than the third generation iPad, just so much more lighter. Use that for video, watching video, um, checking out the website, just browsing uh, the internet in general. Over here to the side, I have my MacBook Pro, which is also picked up recently. This is the 13 inch i5 with 4 gigs of RAM. I'm going to want to probably most likely upgrade that RAM to 8 gigabytes because doing video editing is not good with 4 gigs of RAM. You can barely get anything done. So I definitely want to get that 8 gig, especially when using Final Cut Pro. Uh, for the most part, just uh, I've been using it for editing the website and the app as well. Here to the right of the MacBook Pro, I've got the Galaxy S3, which I kind of just use to mess around with Android when I'm not using the 5S. I most likely won't be keeping this much longer because I want to uh, probably check out the Note 3 or the Nexus 5. I uh, might even just get a Nexus 7 to experience Android uh, more fully. So these are my daily drivers, daily devices that I'm constantly using. Uh, if you have any questions, leave a comment below. And now we're going to look at Timo's daily drivers. Okay guys, so here we've got Timothy, our head of gaming here at iTech Triad. You guys don't see him in too many videos due to the fact that he lives in Florida and Ben and I are in North Carolina. Nonetheless, Timo's visiting us today and he's going to talk about his daily drivers and how they help him stay productive here at iTech Triad. So Timo, here's the mic. Tell him about your daily driver. Well, I got the iPod Touch 5th generation. I got the blue version, 32 gigabyte. Nothing on Just 32 gigabyte. And what I usually use it for? Words with friends. Of course I use it for words with friends. I send text messages when I have Wi-Fi. And phone calls? I got my mom's phone for that. You know, that's all I need. Actually, I got one more thing. Ben, hit me up. 
PlayStation 3 controller. I use this more than the iPod, I think. It's, I'm always with it. I'm always with it. Um, Timo, I don't, I don't think there's any Wi-Fi. Can you send a text or do you want to use my phone? Are you serious? Yeah, that's, that's sad. We need to get you a phone. Okay guys, so that's going to do it here for our room tour. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, let's take one last look at the office itself. Here we've got Timothy playing words with friends. Hope he's having a good time. That's enough of Timothy. Let's take one last look at the entire office. Again, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Give it a thumbs up. Share it with your friends. And also be sure to check out our official applications, which are live in four app stores. We'll leave the links to all those in the description below. If you have any questions regarding these products, also comment below, and we'll be sure to try and answer as many as possible. So thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you in our next video.